Good morning, everybody, everyone over on YouTube and over on SoundCloud. Now, there's one thing I want to talk about, um, and this is, again, one of those videos or one of these podcasts that we don't normally talk a whole lot about, but it's something that's been on my mind a couple of days, and I just can't believe I'm seeing what I'm seeing. And we're going to talk about the, the kids that are using these laundry pads, pods, I should say, you know, the ones that you could put in your, yeah, you guys know what it is. And these kids are eating them. You're just putting them in their mouth, crushing them down. And, you know, I look at the society that we live in, some brainwashed, don't know how to research their own facts, you know, zombies. And that's basically what, you know, the, the liberals are. They're fucking zombies. They just want to listen to everyone else and do what everyone else tells them, but can't can't fathom the thing for themselves, you know, and guys, and guys like it, I, I, well, no, I don't get it, again, you guys have kids out here eating pods, looking like a fucking Ninja Turtle just gave them a facial, I mean, it's, do you kids realize what you guys look like when you guys, the rest of society's laughing at you guys, you guys look like little amateur porn stars trying to take facials to the face by a Ninja Turtle, that's, that's pretty messed up, that is pretty messed up. Like, what the hell is wrong with you guys? Why can't you guys, as a society, why couldn't we just stick with, you know, snorting pixie sticks? I mean, even back then, that was stupid as hell. You know, I'm 32 years old, and I look back at it when I was a kid. And I remember watching my friends sitting at lunch, you know, thinking it was the cool thing to do. And I, even back then, I was sitting there thinking that, that that's just retarded. You know, why do something with something that was not intended for that use? Obviously, it's not made to be attended. Now, kids, do you realize what you're putting in your fucking mouths? Like, did you guys actually take the time out to read what kind of chemicals you guys are putting out? But yet, everyone wants to sit there and yell GMOs, ge genetically modified foods and shit like that. They're all cool with that, but when it comes to doing dares and challenges, you got suicide challenge, the pod challenge, and again, man, you guys are eating that shit, and it's just gooing down your face, and it just looks nasty, and just, what's so entertaining about that? You know, grown-ups, when we see you guys on Facebook doing this, we are shaking our heads, calling you guys fucking morons. And even your parents are fucking morons for not even keeping an eye on what you're doing. And I get that, I mean... I mean more, more likely, most of these kids are probably out doing it without their parents knowing about it until they sign on Facebook and see their kid sitting there smashing on some some lavender tide or something like that. You know, but I mean, it's just, it shows the mentality of our younger generation. This is the next generation of Americans that's going to run this country. And they're eating fucking Tide Pods. I don't know, guys. I don't, I don't know how that's going to work. I don't know. It's, it's, it's retarded. And I don't say that word very nicely, you know, I got a, I got a three-year-old, you know, um, with Turner Syndrome. She's not mentally challenged, or she is, but not to, you know, an extent, um, you know, just learning disabilities and stuff like that. She's perfectly normal, though. Like, if you was to look at her, you wouldn't be able to tell, other than she's real small, real small in stature, so... You know, when I see this next generation of kids, teenagers <clears throat> growing up, and I'm watching them on Facebook or Instagram or Twitter or, you know, hell, even here on YouTube, these kids are doing some of the stupidest things without thinking of the consequences that follow. I can't wait, and, and forgive me for saying this, but I can't wait to hear about the first kid that died that ingested too much Andre soup. Or... Someone's going to post on on Facebook saying, this is what happens when you let your kid eat laundry detergent. They shit and fill up the toilet with bubbles. I don't know. That's just my opinion, guys. All right. I'm out.